God is saying to you today, my dear child, the next 11 minutes are very crucial for your entire life, so please don't skip this message from me, this is your time, it has come. You're about to collect your rewards, and your prayers will be answered, however, a bit more patience and guided action on your part is required. The extra weight and effort are definitely worth it, you're just about there, your spirit guides ask you to keep your faith about miracles in heaven. Use your imagination to visualize that your dreams have already come true, your heart will swell with gratitude and joy, and these emotions will speed up your desired manifestations. Before long, you'll be enjoying the tangible results. Type 111 If you trust God, God is saying to you today, it doesn't matter how much they hate you or talk about you. I am still going to bless and elevate you, they can't stop what I am about to do in your life. Keep moving forward, like this video if you have belief in God, yes, it is time for a move. Angels and your spirit guides are working to keep your spirit and energy high during this move. All that is requested is your trust, trust that the divine and the angels are capable of finding just the right place for you. If you decide on one certain place, and it doesn't work out, it is because they are bringing you something that's even better, expect miracles to occur that allow you to afford this change. Stay positive and don't buy into illusions or scarcity thinking, the angels will smooth the way and will also help you meet new people who can illuminate your path, God has a way of exceeding our expectations, even when we are beginning to feel overwhelmed. The only thing we have to do, though, is trust His timing and continually pursue His will. He is still able to heal that sickness. God is still able to meet that financial need. God is still able to bring peace to that depression. God is able to provide that spouse you've prayed and waited for. Not only is He able to do it, but God is able to do more than you could have imagined. Trust Him. Type 222 If you believe in God, Heavenly Father, I may not understand how everything will work out but I trust you. I don't see a way, but I know you will make a way, I have faith that at this very moment, you are touching hearts, opening doors, and lining up the right breaks and right opportunities, things may look dark and bleak now, but I have faith that my dawn is coming. In Jesus' name, get ready for an empowering plot twist coming up on your journey. Your spirit's ability to feel everything was never a weakness, it was your secret weapon all along. You have the ability to detect good and bad energies at the blink of an eye, you are pure magic. What works for your soul doesn't have to be understood by anyone else. Your direction in life is about to miraculously change for the better, focus on the wise words of your intuition, whatever it's telling you, keep listening. It's all working out in your favor. This prayer is titled, I claim it in Jesus' name. Amen, I know that I serve a God who is bigger than anything that I am facing today. No matter what happens or what the outcome will be, I know that He is in control and He has a plan for my life, a plan that will prosper me and not harm me, one that will give me a bright future. I don't know if that means that I am going to be healed, have my relationships restored, experience a financial breakthrough, be married, or have children. However, I find so much peace in knowing that He is taking care of me and will always provide. I will never lack or be without as long as I continue walking with Him. God heard your prayer last night. He felt the anxiety the anguish, the confusion, and the pain. He saw the tears you shed for your parents, your children, your friends, your situation. God is saying to you today, for every teardrop, for every sleepless night, I have a blessing for you. 
You're coming out of this, I have sent a regiment of angels to clear the path for you. The pain you're feeling is coming to an end. Blessings, healing, miracles, solutions, and my divine favor are coming your way, remember, my child, weeping may endure for a night, but joy comes in the morning, type, yes, to affirm, there are times in our lives when things happen that we just don't understand. When I don't understand something about God, I try to always fall back on what I do understand. I do understand that God loves me. I do understand that He is looking out for me with my best interests in mind. I do understand that no matter what happens, He will get me through. Type I am becoming aware to claim it, we all go through seasons of difficulty and face storms in life. But during those times, we have to remember that Almighty God is greater than any struggle we face, He'll take those challenges and use them to strengthen us. But we have to do our part and take a step of faith toward the victory. Think about the caterpillar before it becomes a butterfly, when it's wrapped in its dark cocoon on the backside of some tree. It doesn't look like it has many options. But inside that cocoon, as it becomes a butterfly, it doesn't just sit and wait for someone to come and let it out, no, that butterfly knows that it has to make a move if it's going to be set free to fly. In the same way, we have to do something to get out of the confining places we are in, we have to pray, we have to believe, and we have to press through to victory. Today, no matter what you may be facing, remember that His grace is sufficient for you. His strength is made perfect in you. He has given you everything you need to overcome in this life. Now is the time to break free and rise to new levels because He has victory and blessing prepared for you. Rest, beloved child, in the loving arms of His peace, just a reminder, in case your mind is messing with you, tonight, God heard your prayer. You are going to be okay. God is making a way for you. Angels have been sent to comfort you, God has a great plan for your life. You can do all things through Christ. Blessings are coming your way. You matter. You're important. You're loved, type 777, if you're ready, don't let anybody put you in a box. God will call you to do things that people have never seen before. Other people aren't supposed to understand. They will get it after they see you do it. So, keep stepping out in faith. Keep standing when the tests come. Keep trailblazing. Keep showing up, even when you're the only one. I see you. Don't stop. Harvest season always comes to those who don't give up. When you understand that God is ordering your steps, that nothing can happen to you without His permission, then you won't fall apart when the pandemic hits. You won't live bitter when someone does you wrong. You won't give up on your dream when life throws you a curve. That setback is only setting you up to go further. God had the solution before you had the problem. He's already set the time to turn it around. Set the time to open the right door, set the time to bring you out, promoted, vindicated, healthy, and whole. Type I am ready to shine, to affirm, God says the things you've been through have taken something away. You've lost some shine, you've lost some of your innocence, and along the way, you've also lost you, you don't do the things you love to do, you don't get excited the way you did in the old days. But if you'll take my hand, I have a plan. I'm going to teach you how to war for your happiness, how to contend for your joy. Child, I'm going to show you how to intercede for your own soul, and at the end of it all, you'll have your fire back, 
God says the reason you find it hard to believe you're capable of great things is that the enemy has taken great care to ensure you've had enough attacks, setbacks, pain, and failures that you question yourself. But it's a lie. One of the devil's great deceptions. You are called to greatness, you do have a magnificent destiny on your life, you can do all things through my Son, Jesus Christ. And now is your season. Get ready because destiny winds are blowing over your life, type I embrace my power, to affirm. God is saying to you today, I know you have been struggling for a long time, financially, spiritually, and emotionally. You have a good heart, and people have abused you in many ways, the devil has tried to make you lose your mind many times. You have been betrayed in many ways, yet you stand in the midst of your storms. You are still here because I am with you, I will not allow any weapon that is formed against you to prosper. Fear not. I am going to turn things around and bless you in the presence of your enemies. Hold on to your faith, God has a plan. When things happen that we don't understand, it's easy to think, why did this happen? Why did this friend betray me? Why did this company lay me off? Why didn't I get that promotion? You can't let the things you don't understand keep you stuck on the same page in the story of your life. You have to decide to turn the page so that you can see the victory waiting for you in the next chapter. If you are facing a difficulty today, Know that God's plan is to turn it around and use it for your good. The story of your life isn't over. Keep moving forward. Keep believing. Keep hoping. Keep forgiving because your days are written out for good. It's time to turn the page and see the blessing He has in store for your life. God saw the way He played with your heart, the way He toyed with your emotions, how he lied when he didn't have to, why wasn't the truth enough? Why wasn't integrity enough? Because truth and integrity are never enough for people who consciously choose the dark, God will handle it. For now, you have to handle you. It's time to heal. It's time to get back to you, but most importantly, it's time to lean on the Lord. Let God rebuild and redirect you in this hour, type 1313 to claim it, you are divinely scheduled to evolve at this point in your life. You are passionate. You are spiritual. You are magic. Never deny any aspects of who you are. A healthy soul is a whole soul. Remember, you get there by realizing you are already there. Your mind is healing, your body is healing, your heart is healing. Welcome all sorts of love, good health, abundance, positive energy, and good people into your life by keeping a gratitude mindset. You are attracting all good things that will align with your energy. Open up your consciousness and see yourself in the light of who you truly are. Type, yes, if you trust. Stay in your light. You are supported and protected. Speak your word of intention, and it will be fulfilled. Speak your word of frequency. And it will be given unto you a thousandfold. You are a divine being in essence and you have the right to create miracles. Align, it is all just your decision. Your power to affirm, God is saying to you tonight, the pain is coming to an end. I am going to open up the windows of heaven and pour out everything you've been waiting and praying for, blessings of love, prosperity, healing, and new opportunities are coming your way. Take care of yourself. Type, yes, if you're ready and share this video with five people who trust God. Comment, Jesus is Lord, to support our channel. 
Please subscribe to our channel and turn on bell notifications, no one is going to stand up and hand you a plate of progress in life. You must make progress by your sheer will, discipline, and efforts every day, 10 verses from the Bible that the Lord Jesus wants you to hear right now, 1. Believe in the Lord with all of your heart and don't rely on your own comprehension, and submit to Him in all your actions, He will make your pathway straight. 2. Have I not obeyed my commands? Take bravery and strength because the Lord your God is with you everywhere you go. There is no need to be scared or disheartened. 3. The Lord reveals, for I know the strategies I have for you, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to grant you hope and a future. 4. You will also receive all of these things if you put God's kingdom and righteousness first, though, 5. And we are aware that God always helps us, who adore Him and are summoned according to His plan, 6. It is necessary to be quiet and understand that I am God, I will be exalted among the nations and will be exalted in the earth. He will be with you as a result of His love and grace. 7. Consider this, God is our refuge and power, an ever-present aid in times of difficulty. Do not be concerned. And do not be concerned, He will assist us in every circumstance. 8. God has not provided us with a spirit of cowardice and fear, but rather a spirit of force, love, and sound thinking. 9. Since the Lord God is the Son and the Guard, and the Lord gives mercy and love, He does not deny His supporters anything beneficial. 10. The Lord is gracious and merciful, slow to wrath and bounteous in mercy. God is good to all and has compassion on all His creatures. Like this video and subscribe to the channel if you believe in God. Type, I really love you God. And if you believe in Christianity, kindly show your support for our community by contributing super thanks, from $10 to a $20. God bless you my child, like the video so that it can reach more people who are seeking my blessings, subscribe the channel to claim all your wishes, type, Amen.